Am I supposed to do that? I don't know. Peek out. <laughs> Hello, folks. Welcome Hello. back to. <laughs> you don't even know who we are. I don't know what. A couple of drinks of the clerks. Today is Bourbon Harry's month, day 21. We are one of the. Oh, Legal what drinking age. What, what do you call it? It's uh, three weeks in. <laughs> She's and back. Dogs, and three dogs in. Oh, oh there's Pat. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's make my drink. So, my wife, of course, is on her social media page. So, she found this cocktail. What was it called again? Um, cherry Bomb Soda. Cherry Bomb Soda. Bourbon okay. Cherry Bomb right. Soda. So, we're going to do a couple of black do cherries. four black cherries apiece. Mm, I like it, the black cherries. Now, here's the thing. Why are we doing black cherries? I know, because red stag. Red stag. <laughs> Did you just call me a red stag? <laughs> <laughs> no. Red stag, folks, by Jim Beam. Yes, this is bourbon. This is Black Kentucky cherry. straight bourbon whiskey infused with natural flavors. Black cherry. Now, this stuff, I was around when this stuff launched. And actually, it's kind of ironic because we're doing this show with uh, Red Stag because I want a contest to go to Las Vegas and watch Kid Rock perform because Kid Rock was part of the uh, uh, promotions for Jim Beam. Mm. And I got to meet Vinny Paul. The photo is on my Facebook page. So, wow. God rest his soul. Awesome, <laughs> awesome metal drummer, Vinny Paul. And what the cool thing was is I snuck into his VIP area, and he had this gigantic dude with bald head, goatee that stuck on like this, and this guy was just a monster. He was this security guard. So I go, hey, buddy, you want to take our picture? <laughs> did he? Yeah, he did. He goes, you got a lot of balls. I go, I go, wow. No, sir. I go, no, I go, sir, it's the Jim Beam. No comment. <laughs> so. We're going to do this thing, Cherry Mountain. So, we've got black cherries in there sticking with the theme. And then we're going to, my wife is going to muddle them. We're going to throw a little bit of, I, I'm all done with of sugar. I, I worked all day today. You're going to do what I say, woman. Here's your muddler. We'll pretend. I'll pretend like you're the boss. <laughs> okay, muddle away, please. If this squirt is squirting in the face. It's taking your song. Mm. So, folks, Red Stag was first launched, um, and from, if the memory serves me correctly, this might be a fabrication, but Red Stag, down in Louisville, they are big sports fans, okay? So, the people who work at Jim Beam started putting black cherries that grow in the area into the Jim Beam and, like, steeping it and getting it flavored so they would you do that with tailgating with football games and stuff like that so some of the higher ups and jim being like hey wait a second what is that let's make that so that's pretty cool how are we doing i think i <laughs> i moved the side so people can see what i'm doing for muddling and then i saw how i looked when i was muddling i thought i should have put the side back oh sorry but <laughs> wow anyway so now we add Jim, and seriously, you know, I mean, I know this is like a show and we're, Cherry bomb. And, and we love each other and everything, but why are you like on me? Like, here's me, and like, there's there's way more room over here. Any ideas? Okay. Moving along. <laughs> yeah, you're just better off keeping your mouth shut yeah. for the bourbon. <laughs> now, this is one and a half ounces. Of Jim Beam, the, the only Kentucky and Straight Bourbon Red Stag with black cherry flavor, all natural. I can't wait to try this. And of course, black cherry is salsa. I oh. thank you. I should do a little stirring. <laughs> I'm just gonna get closer. <laughs> so bad, so bad. You're hot too. I know. Thank you very much. <laughs> Whatever. 
Oh, I'm sorry. Did you want? Oh. No, not double dipping my. Did you want to taste? I will when you pour my drink in there. See how I poured you first. Nice. Okay, easy. You're not very nice. This is. <laughs> I don't want any more soda. Don't ruin it. That's nice. Ruben was Ruben. So I was listening to the working on the set last night down in the basement. And yeah. I'm listening to 80 songs. And when you play it on Alexa, they give you the words to the 80s song. Oh, yeah? Oh, yeah. You're I, totally butchering everything. Everything. Right I have sung songs so wrong my whole entire there's life. One, there's one Journey song. That for the longest time, it, I, I think it's Escape from Journey. And there's the part where, where I, I had to rewind it and look yeah. at the lyrics. It's, it honestly sounds like Steve Perry says, Ron and Stan will change your mind. What did they say? It's something like running scared will change your mind. I'm like, you swear to God, he thought he said Ron and Stan. Well, I thought Stevie Nicks always sang about a one way, a, a one winged dove, not wow. a white winged dove. <laughs> Just keep. I mean, moving. people don't people don't want to hear our business. All Cheers, right. love you. Is that you. Cheers, love you. That's dangerous. My buddy Danny loves this stuff. Holy! I wonder if he's ever had it like this. We're gonna have to have him over and and have yeah. him. Oh anyway, my God. folks, remember, oh, bourbon Black heritage Cherry month. And bourbon. bourbon heritage month. We are three weeks in. A couple of drinks from the Clarks. We are the Clarks, and it's dancing is everything. Day twenty-one. See, she's got me all screwed up. She over here. I'm too close. Say goodbye to the nice folks. <laughs> goodbye, nice folks. <laughs>